The forest area of Siddipet district is 56,220 acres, which constitutes 6.26% of total geographical area of district, and the average annual rainfall is 831 millimeters. These forests are classified as southern, tropical, dry, deciduous, mixed forests, which shed their leaves during winter. To achieve the national goal of 33% tree cover, extensive plantations have been taken up in the district with the initiative under the flagship program of the government, Telangana Kuharita Haram. So far, two crore seedlings have been planted in the district and another two and a half crores will be planted in the next two years in other than reserve forest areas. In reserve forests so far, 12,000 acres plantations are raised. With an aim to treat total forest area, assisted natural regeneration works are being taken up to rejuvenate the natural forest in an area of 42,400 acres in the district. In Gajwel constituency alone, 17,129 acres are being treated by assisted natural regeneration. These works include protecting the area from the biotic interference by digging of peripheral trench all along the boundary of forest block or cluster of blocks and planting the mounds with Cecilpina Banduk or Gachakaya. Creating fire lines of 5 meter width along road or boundary and 3 meter width along sectors demarking sectors for 25 to 30 hectares. As fire accidents have become regular phenomena in these forest areas, these fire lines will have a remarkable effect in controlling fires and mitigating the fire damage. Removal of thorny unwanted jungle growth, singling out of coppice growth which is suppressing the regeneration and also creating congestion and competition to the growing stock of minor forest produce and timber yielding species. This will improve the productivity of the growing stock for the benefit of dependent communities and will pay for the rural economy by way of minor forest produce yield like sitafal, usiri, karaka, gachakaya and other forestry seed. Soil and moisture conservation works like rock fill dams, staggered contour trenches, check dams and percolation tanks, etc. will be taken up to improve the moisture regime of the forest. These activities will add to the amelioration of microclimate of the respective localities and thereby the floral and fauna diversity will also be improved considerably.